you can mm -hmm. write the best code the best features, but if people don't really understand what they're doing, they're never going to like appreciate it. They're never going to like buy your product. One insight I'd love to get from you, given that uh, you know you work with uh, technical teams on your day to day and sort of scaling that, as you mentioned earlier. Um, now you know you, you haven't met most of the folks you work with uh, in your team in person yet, uh, and I'm curious, like any insights you can share on like how the company is continuously building like scalable technical teams, like having that, as you mentioned, like small team feels. Uh, but like having thousands of, of you know engineers working together in this you know singular platform that's so uh, I guess like um, that's uniform across the board without having to have like a uh, a chaos of of a product. It's really interesting because um, there's not like a easy answer. Like if people can ask <laughs> the question, I think for sure. me and. I think the answer is really like, we just really, really care about that. Pa Patrick, like if you follow him on Twitter, the, mm -hmm. the CEO, well, he'll be like constantly posting things like, hey, here are like ambitious engineering projects that got built mm -hmm. in like six months. I think we just have this vibe that's like, we're gonna try to do stuff in a really like mm -hmm. scalable and ambitious way. And we're gonna try to do it really fast at the same time. And we're just kind of gonna like keep trying to do that until, mm -hmm. <laughs> until it works. I think we do try to like build things in in the right way. One thing that kind of surprised me about Stripe coming from like a very small startup was how much it was like a little bit more upfront work to kind of build something that would last longer. But I think ultimately it's kind of like something that makes you go faster in the long term. Because, you know, if you're building like a new product or a new feature, you can build it on top of a bunch of foundations that you can really rely on. Right. And then the next person that comes along can build their thing on top of your thing. And of course, like maintenance is always something that right. you have to worry about. Mm -hmm. But um, generally, I feel like we put like a really high emphasis on that kind of like stability and like making sure things are like built the right way. And that's been really good. I guess like a wonder in terms of like the product development cycle in terms of how you're pushing, uh, balancing your opinion on what the developer tool should be. Uh, and I guess getting the feedback of the users and how do you incorporate that in, I guess, the development of the developer tool product itself? I would say that for me, it's like 100% about mm -hmm. the users. And I think right. that's something that okay. I think should really always be true. Okay. It's mm -hmm. all about like, what are people trying to achieve? How can you give them like the best buttons or tools to get that thing done? Mm -hmm. And the technology is just still like a means to an end. So whether it's like at Apollo or at Stripe, like one of the very first things we do is like talk to users and be like, what do you need? Mm -hmm. um, before we like write any code or like come up with any design. So I think that at the end of the day, you need to be able to reach an agreement that's like, hey, what's best for mm -hmm. Stripe's actual users and for which Got users? It. Got it. And I think that's the thing that I've been like extremely stoked about at Stripe is I've always felt like everyone cares the most about what the users need. Like if you walk into some conversation and it feels like things are getting complicated, like everyone will be on board if you're just like, hey, let's take a step back. Like what is mm -hmm. actually best for the users? Mm -hmm. You know, like well, you have your goals. I have my goals. We all have goals. That's very cool. But like, <laughs> let's put that aside for a second. Right. Um, I think that's like the most important thing. Mm -hmm.